in the gospel text of today, which is taken from the gospel of Luke chapter 13 verses 10 to 17, we will read about a miracle but also a controversy. And the reason why the miracle creates a controversy is because it is performed on the Sabbath. The Sabbath was given to the people as an indication that they, like God, were much more than their work. A person would not identify him or herself with her work or with his work and that is why the Sabbath rest. So on the Sabbath, I distance myself from my work. I go away from my work to show that I am much more than my work. So if God rested, as Genesis tells us, on the seventh day, it is not saying that God needed to rest his weary bones. It is saying that God needed to distance himself to show that he is more than his work and humans who are created in the image and likeness of God are also more than their external activity, more than all they do, more than their action and that is the purpose of the rest. The rest could not be made an end in itself. The Sabbath could not be made an end in itself. It was made for the human person, not the human person for the Sabbath. And so on this Sabbath day, there is a woman in the synagogue where Jesus is and the woman is bent and we are told that she has suffered from this ailment for 18 years for Jesus. 18 years is 18 years too many and he will not wait for the Sabbath to pass in order to heal the woman. He heals her immediately because for Jesus, human need took priority over any rule and regulation. The rule and regulation was important. The rule and regulation helped to maintain order and decorum, but the rule and regulation could not be an end in itself. And at the time of Jesus, there were 39 forms of work which were forbidden on the Sabbath. And one of them was working like Jesus does to work a miracle. And so the leader of the synagogue is upset. And while he does not address Jesus, he addresses the woman and the others saying that there are six other days when you can do this work. Why do you choose the Sabbath? The point is that it was not the Sabbath that was chosen. It was the human need that was chosen. So the leader of the synagogue has it the other way around because his focus is on the rule and on the breaking of the rule therefore. But because Jesus' focus is not on the rule or but on the human person, that is why he cannot really consider himself as breaking the Sabbath as much as he considers himself as helping a human to live a dignified life. And so today, there are rules and regulations which are important and which are required and which we must follow if order is to be maintained in society. However, we must never We must never let the rule or regulation ever become an end in itself. Human need always takes priority over rules. We do not let the rules rule us because the Sabbath and the rule was made for the human person, not the human person for the Sabbath or the rule. Will you never allow rules to rule you?